Hey, what's up guys? And welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. And in the last episode, I forgot to show you this. So yeah, I'm showing it to you right now. This is a graveyard that I made on like episode 23 or 24. I don't, I honestly don't remember because my memory is really bad about that kind of stuff. And we've got, this is a graveyard and it's for tools and here lies work pick. Unknown anything. I didn't even check when this was born either. So I'm a very I'm very bad at keeping track of stuff, so just letting you know. And there's actually like my old pick there, which you can't repair anymore and that's why I put it there. I didn't want to like have it go to waste. It's my first ever pick. Well, proper pick. Oh yeah, I don't I don't remember. I think I accidentally lost my original work pick in lava. And I just copied this over pretty much after a few hours, but anyway, um, I I was gonna work on the tunnel today, like before I recorded, but I decided screw it. I'm tired of it, so maybe there's something else I could do. Hopefully, the iron farm or the gold farm. The gold farm and the iron farm will both take absolutely ages to do, but what I would really like to do is not do that. I just made an extra addition to the ice farm. Probably do this or this. But yeah, let's see what we get. Gold farm. All right, so need dark oak. Um, some dark oak saplings. I'll I'll just take the whole lot, and I need some of this. Probably not that much, actually. Now I'll need to have a lot of resources, but anyway, I'll see you in the nether even though I absolutely hate it now, but yeah, see you there. Alright, so I'm in the nether, just built the nether hub, and hopefully no lava will come raining down on me as I climb up here to the top of the nether, because that's where I'm going to be building the, nether, the gold farm, right at the top, above the ceiling even, and I will be able to... Ah, I didn't bring dirt. That's a bummer. But yeah, that's the bedrock. Um, so, so now I just need to... Will I make it... I'll make it to this level. Oh, I can make it all the way down as well. Okay. Okay, do I have any dirt here? Doesn't look like it, so I'll have to go back for more. Uh, the idea is... I will probably need a ton more stone for this. Um, and as you know, big projects take up lots of stuff. And I don't know. Like I would have made it with clay, but uh, but I haven't found a mace biome yet, so no, can't do it yet. Just take a stack of dirt real quick. Make a bunch of ladders as well. They will be needed a lot. Like a lot. Okay, good. Uh, will that be enough? I'm not sure. Also, since last episode, I built this thing, so looks all right. Um, need to just put something underneath it to make it look even better. Maybe you could guys tell me what I should do. And yeah, I will. Sorry about that being so loud. Um, I will just go up back up here. Oh yeah, by the way, um, I'm doing a little bit of a challenge I set myself. I am going vegetarian in Minecraft for five episodes. I know it's crazy. So I'm only allowed. I'm not allowed to eat any food. I am allowed to kill animals still because vegetarians can kill animals, right? Don't tell me they can't. That's that's just stupid if they can't. So yeah. I will be breeding my my animals. Um, so after I finish being vegetarian, that will be awesome. Uh, so on episode th 31, I'll be able to eat meat again. So I'll be very happy when that happens. But for now, um, let's just widen this a little bit. Just a little bit. Um, we call this up because I like picking up blocks. It makes me feel better. Do this, um, plant some of this, 
and hopefully not die. Uh, now this might not grow and this trick might not work anymore, I don't know actually. Um, it was a pretty well known trick back in the day. Um, I do remember that this would take absolutely ages to do. I'm not sure bedrock affects it. I think it's the netherrack that's there. Okay, um, I'm doing something wrong, clearly, so I'll, I might have to search it up. Um, I'll place it down a few blocks lower. And that gas is really annoying me, and it sounds like it's Sounds like it's right up there. I swear it's right up there. It would actually pretty, it would actually really scare me, scare me if I went up there and, and was just self shooting. Come on, grow, grow. But do you need light? I'll give you light. Okay, I need to do some research. Alright, so I found out, um, I did my research and I found out that it is no longer a thing to use dark oak to break upwards. Um, pretty sure it still works downwards though, um, so it's worth trying when, when I want to get down. Actually, I'll try it like, right away probably. Okay, that's a bad spot. Um, but I found a few ways to get up and I only really like one of them, um, so... That's what I'm gonna go with. Um, it is. You basically. Ah, I forgot to bring a minecart. You right back. On the other hand, I just I just remembered that you don't need a minecart for it. It's a different one that I watched. You need to have a minecart, but uh, so that's one twenty-seven. Do this something like this. Uh, oof. Wait, I want this. I want the one of the pistons here. Right? Uh just like I I'll just run a little bit of wire here. Of course. Uh now it works. Good. So then I put a half slab there. Yeah. Okay. Get my ender pearls and Prepare to die basically, but hopefully not die. Okay, I'm in. Okay, 127 I'm looking at right now, so let's get this right. Wait, I'm... I'm gonna die! I made it. Oh yeah. I made it. Whew, that was actually really stressful. And now I have no idea where I am. There's an endermite here, so this must be it. I'll just check the cords on the video, so yeah. Okay, right here, so I'm just gonna mark this spot. Um, actually, I need to mark it. Probably don't, but I will just in case. Um, so yeah, we're now on top of the nether, which I'm very happy about. This makes no sense right here, so that makes more sense. And I didn't actually know that there's mushrooms up here. This this is pretty cool, actually. He's downstairs. I think that they're downstairs because like, when I was coming down, I got attacked by guards. So yeah. Okay, so now I'll just quickly try get get myself down. So this should work on getting down. They shouldn't have changed that. Um, so I bought a ton of bone meal with me. Well, bones so far. Bone meal, it is now. Okay, brew. It it works fine. Oh, please tell me this still works. I also bought another portal, so I, I mean obsidian to build another portal in case this fails. So, it should be fine. I uh, it can take a few t tries to do this. Um, uh, I don't actually know. Last time I've seen this done is in what was in 1.7. Just, just to say. 
So this might actually not work. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's gonna work, but I'll keep trying. I'm determined. Look, it looks like in 1.9 slash 1.8 they changed it so that dark, the way dark oak wood grows. So might need to like put a block here or something. Like that's not actually wood. Do something like this. That might make it change its direction of growth. It's supposed to grow downwards and these are very destructive trees. Very destructive. So it's supposed to like break the bedrock underneath it. But it doesn't look like it's gonna work, so that sucks. Okay, uh so for now I'm just gonna do a simple portal to get out of here. But Eventually I'll break the bedrock. There there are a few more ways to do it, but I just haven't tried them yet. But did I bring enough? It would be a big pain if I didn't bring enough. Okay, I bought enough. Although if I didn't bring enough, I can always break mine the chest with with the normal pick, with this pick to get it, so I guess I guess it would have been fine. So that will take me back down, but I don't want to go back down yet. This tree has loads of leaves on it, to no surprise. But yeah, I'll start setting up some chests here. And Did I just hear something? Never mind. Um, I'll just set up some chests here and store all my stuff. Climbing up. I don't think I'll have enough blocks to get all the way up as far as I need to go. I think I need to go up like up to two fifty. Nah, that's way too far. Uh, I'll probably go up to like 100, I mean 200, but yeah. Suicide, just kidding. Like this, yeah. Um, still a lot of blocks, I think. Uh, but yeah, do ladders now. And I should have probably put a light up there because now ghosts can spawn up there. So right now, I'm actually thinking whether I should make an easy... Well, there's two ways I know that I, like, I definitely know how to build a, a zombie farm, yeah? One of these zombie pigment farms, yeah? Is to either go up, like, really high and have one of those where you shoot one of the pigmen and they all stream towards you but then fall down and you get the XP still because they were aggro at you, yeah? Which is... Which will take a lot of blocks to build, or I could build here a different kind of farm which uses pistons to push um, the pigment down and it causes a lot of lag but it works and trust me it, it's way better than that probably. Well it's not better but it's best for me and I can send them through the portal and then kill them in the net. Uh, back in the overworld, so I think that's actually what I'm gonna do. So I'm just gonna tear this down because I'm gonna restart. But the benefits of building up here um, is like, like up here on top of the world um, is that no gas can spawn unless I give them enough space to. So I'll just half slap everything pretty much. Well, apart from the bedrock, they won't they won't spawn there. As I say that, <laughs> he shouldn't be anywhere near us, though. And the pigment shouldn't be aggro at me here, because, um, well, because I I didn't shoot them, so they shouldn't aggro the pigment back in the Nether. So I can actually build it like here instead of having to go masses way up. So this is what I'm gonna do for now, basically. Um, I will build several pigment farms probably over the course of my life here. Um, I hate ghosts. They can't spawn a leaf, right? But yeah, I will actually now use the portal because I need way more blocks than this. Um, I'll leave a bunch here. Okay, let's see where this takes us. Hopefully not in a random place. Oh, please not! don't be in a random place. Fingers crossed. Oh, nice. <laughs> Very nice. That was, that was perfect. Perfect. 
But yeah, I'll do a cup now. They keep coming here for some reason. Like, I don't know why they, but they always spawn here. Probably because I'm in the area, but why, why like right outside my nether hub? Why? So, uh, I just set a bunch of uh, stone, um, sorry, cobblestone to cook and a, bu a bunch of iron because this will need a lot of pistons and probably a whole bunch of redstone as well. But, um, I can see this project being finished in, like, the next three episodes, or maybe actually two if I bother to do stuff. Um, may have to do the suicidal thing this time again, um, to get up. I should have enough with... Okay, I, I should have enough to get, uh, at least somewhere in the project. Okay. I'm, I'm, right now, I'm in, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die! No! Ah! That's why we have backup gear. I need this to become in useful someday. Three ender pills really won't be enough, would it? <sighs> okay. Hopefully we don't die this time. Although, with the amount of stuff I have, probably, probably will. No! Ah! Okay, so, fast forwarding a little bit, I managed to get all my stuff back, um, and I managed to puncture the holes, finally. I punctured four because I could, although that bedrock right there, I will have to re-puncture that as well, although I don't think I'll be able to, actually. So this really sucks, actually, because I can't puncture that bedrock. There's just simply not enough space to do what I need to. But I started designing my, um, Thing. So down here, imagine that this outer thing is going to be a big portal, and so is this. Um, it's all going to be a big portal. Then over here, um, there's going to be uh, what's it called? Pistons, yeah, pistons, and they're going to be running on a clock. And the wire wire is going to go up on this block here. Oh come on! Um, and yeah, they're going to be running on the clock. It's going to be uh, uh, like well, every 10 seconds um, is, is going to be triggered so all the pigment that have collected down there will be sent away into the overworld and I will have set up a portal that is close to these kind of coordinates so that it actually connects to them because otherwise it will just connect to my portal and it will have a crap ton of pigment running around my house and I don't want that I honestly don't so yeah might be running out of time now because of me trying to get back up here. I'm surprised I wasn't able to do it the first time actually. Didn't expect I would. Uh, you probably forgot. There's probably like one or two more things up there that I didn't break. Um, but yeah, after this level, we're gonna have the spawn pads, which are gonna be uh, quite simple actually. Um, there's something I need to experiment with uh, off camera of the way that the spawn pads are triggered but basically there's going to be like I don't know three rows of this it's going to be a big three by three thing of this probably so it's going to be nine of these things in total um, and let me just think that's eight there eight here so that's um, that's 16 and then this will probably go up like I don't know how I don't, I don't know how many times it will go up it will probably go up by like um, fourth. This, this is actually pretty tough um, I don't know how much it will go up by it'll go up like 10 so it's 160 times by 9 I can't do that math so it's like it's just over a thousand spawning spawn spaces though that's actually quite a few and considering that zombies big and little spawn at, uh, like there's a small chance pretty small chance of them getting placed down it's like one in 200 so every tick um or i think it's tick i'm not sure 
there's basically gonna be a lot. If I wanted to like make as many um, spawn, the spawn rate's really high. I build this really high up like the other farm would have been, but just no, no way. And besides, I wouldn't be able to do it with this design. But yeah, uh, spawn pads start here. Um, so I'm gonna have pistons um, making these activate, um, and this is gonna be very laggy, but it won't matter because you'll be AFK. Because um, otherwise, you'd be just standing there doing whatever you are for like I don't know half an hour. And yeah, we don't want to do that. And yeah, this is another project for off camera, I guess. Um, I actually have quite a bit of stuff with me. Um, I'll probably make a minecart track to go up here because, like, it actually really is to get get up here. And I'll probably not make it all fancy like I like I did with my other track because it's not needed. It's just simply not needed to be fancy. It's just going up by like a hundred blocks. Oh, my cold is getting really bad right now. But yeah, let me just check the time on the video. And apparently, uh, the time is quite a bit. Um, so I'm just gonna go back now. And yeah. Oh yeah, there's this guy here. Oh yeah. Ah, the item got taken away. Doesn't matter. Um, yeah, I need to get some TNT. Well, it is that time once again, in which I have to end the episode. Ah, I missed him. Missed him again. My god. Finally. Um, so sorry I didn't do much in this episode. Um, it is actually pretty hard uh, to, like, to, it's a pretty big project that is. And I do hope you will enjoy seeing it after it's built. I sh it shouldn't take me as long as the tunnel is taking me. Um, it shouldn't take me like two episodes to like make, but in between two episodes, possibly three, it will be done by episode thirty for sure. But um, yeah, it's a very useful project because I can make beacons with gold, and yeah, so I can also trade the gold for emeralds. So that's pretty cool. So, yeah, let this blow. Yeah, I didn't expect that, did you? Anyway, um, wait. Oh, screenshot by accident. Um, okay. But yeah, thank you for watching. I, I like these car I mean, potatoes don't last very long. It's pretty much like carrots. Always have to get new new ones. Like, it's ne nearly a stack went by since the last time I recorded. So yeah. See you next time, guys. Bye bye.